All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to episode nine, the final episode of Cooking with Craig. Um, so today it's gonna be a good one. So today we are baking. It's called maki maki is maki esta. I don't I don't know what it, how it's pronounced. It was really long, but um, it was from uh, uh, sweet uh, Sweden, I think, and. Um, yeah, we're about to make that today. So, we already got everything ready. Mom, Mom stop watching TV. Mom. So, we already got everything ready. We got our pie crust ready. Um, we're about to um, make our hardened pie crust in a bit. Well, we have our blueberries set up. Um, and yeah, so, to start off, we're going to, actually, no, we're gonna make the, the crust first. So, to start off, we're gonna get one cup of sour cream. Where's the bit more just a little bit actually all right so that's our cup of sour cream and then we are going to do two tablespoons of milk tablespoon so I gotta pour it four times. Great. You gotta make a mess. Well you don't have to whisper because they can they can already hear you. So. See? I'll do it in the sink. Mom, are you recording? Mm -hmm. Alright. Alright, that's our two tablespoons of milk and then um, one cup of sugar. So hold on, let me wash this sour cream out real quick. Some of them, then some of them, and the blue. So this is bad, like. Half. No, Craig, just drop it. You're shaking it. You don't need to drop it. <laughs> drop it. Mm -hmm. All right. So that's good. Um, and then after that, we're going to add one egg to it. Why 
I use a fork. Yeah, to mix it up and then you could use the whip. cinnamon to it as well because we were supposed to have some vanilla extract but we didn't have any so I'm gonna use some of some of the cinnamon tell me when to stop mom because I don't know how much I should put that's good that's good mm -hmm. you sure mm -hmm. all right and then some uh some ground nutmeg tell me when to stop this one. that's good First. Wash the blueberries first. Get get the strainer. I will get the strainer. This whole time. Get the strainer. Okay. Sugar, huh? Taste to make sure you have enough, like uh, sweet. No, that, uh, when you're tasting, you want to tap a little bit on your hand or something, not the spoon. There's more sugar if you need. What do you think? Bring it up. Yeah, there's... Tell me to stop. Just drop. Stop shaking. Tell me to stop. do that? Shake. So it doesn't come out like that. Tell me to stop. No. You need to pour. I can't see it. Nothing. Pour. Why don't you use the hole? Tell me to stop. Why don't you use the hole? The hole. Turn it around. There you go. And now just pour. That's why I'm shaking. Look. Is that enough? It's a lot. Okay. Is it gonna get hard? Huh? It yeah, like we put it in the oven. Huh? Once we put it in the oven. You need a topper? No, this is it. You don't need some cornstarch? You want to put a little bit of cornstarch in there? No, I'm good. 
What, to make it harder? Mm -hmm. Do you need to put flour, anything? No. No? Because you, you have a spoon. Yeah, take it and. Get the spoon. Take it and like this. Hold on. Give what? it. Give it some. Hold, hold it. Hold, hold it. Just to mix it. No, no. Just to get it out. Okay. Make sure you sit it on the on the thing so that it won't drip. Okay. Mm -hmm. Put it on the on on the tray on the tray. Not that one, the other one. But that has holes in it. Okay, put a four piece of foil paper then, so that it wouldn't drip down in the. Now what we're going to do is we're going to put it in the oven for about 200, 250 degrees for about an hour. And uh, yeah, I'll be back when uh, we're done. See ya.